Good morning. It's only been a little over a week, but you can see this bee bread uh, that I made um, is already starting to form together quite well. Um, I went ahead and turned it over this morning and let it breathe a little bit. Um, and let me just show you, it's gone from the consistency of honey. And down in here, the pollen always rises to the top as you flip it. So what I did is I actually um, kind of pushed it over to the side this morning and let it drain a little bit. And, um, and you can see right here, this is what you're looking for. Um, it's going to turn into, and it almost looks like caramel, uh, a nice, beautiful kind of frosting consistency. You can see the pollen, big chunks of pollen sitting in there. What I'll do is, is as I eat this down, um, again, this is this is kind of the, what I want to eat right here. Um, it's got a small, again, the pollen in it. It's not just um, a big glob of pollen, though, so as I stir this up, etc., this is what I want to eat. Um, but as the as I get down further in the jar and there's, um, you know, less and less of the honey, I'll go ahead and add more honey to this and just continue to let it uh, do its thing, ferment, etc. So, but again, this is looking good. Um, really kind of surprised it got this consistency so fast um, on the stuff that Old Bear made uh, last year. It took several months to get to the consistency of this, so... Um, and we're not sure if he had used um, dehydrated uh, pollen. Um, this was fresh uh, from the cooler. Um, and again, I will be uh, collecting pollen this summer to uh, use everything here right from the, the apiary. So again, enjoy. If you've got any questions, let me know.